Hello, I'm Sablast and in this video we will talk about raw black metal and how to make a raw black metal song. This time we will talk more about recording than about rituals and preparing. Remember, metal is like porn, homemade is the best. First thing we will talk about drums. Drums are an instrument where everyone cheats. It's not a shame to use loops or samples. Some people even put that in their music videos. Like this one for example. I can't show you how to record drums, but I'll give you a tip. Place a microphone in the center of your uh, drum room, record that, only one microphone of course, record that and just add a lot of reverb. That's it. Hope this helps. Let's move on to guitars. Let's talk about recording guitars. First of all, you'll need a cheapest microphone money can buy. Something like this. It was really cheap. <coughs> then, you need something you can put this microphone onto so you can record your amp. Something like a brick or something else your microphone can stand on. But in this video I will show you how pro black metalheads record. Take a knife and take a ball. Now what will happen? You assume it, right? <coughs> now don't stab it 23 times. Now when you made a hole put it in. Not like that. And it should look something like this. Now, how should we make our sound? Well... Okay, this ain't our sound, so... We should add some distortion. I mean, a lot of distortion. Okay, we'll need some highs and trebles for black metal sound. Okay, well. We shouldn't add some lows or bass, but we'll cheat a bit, so... And of course, we need some reverb. A lot of reward. That's it. Now we need a song. Well, let's make some riffs. We need about three riffs typical for black metal, so that's it. Second riff needs to be similar to the first, but a little bit more, you know, punky junky or something, you know. Let's see. Of course, alternate picking is always here. For the third riff, we need some slow riff to create a tension. Something like... Uh... Okay, now we need a riff 
when people hear it, they can say, he can play. I mean, we don't want people to think we can play like Satriani or Petrucci. We don't want to be called technical or uh, progressive. We just want people to say, oh, he plays more than three months. So we need a bit more harder riff than we used to play. So something like... <laughs> Now back to the uh, tension. That's it, four riffs are enough. Let's go to bass guitar. Bass guitar. Of course we won't record a bass guitar on our amp because we need to record it directly into our computer because we can make a better sound like that. I know uh, all producers say that they can hear, hear a difference between an app and plugging it directly to your uh, DAW and using some plugins, but they can hear the difference. So we didn't want to risk that with the guitars, so we you know, recorded it on app, but they can't hear bass guitar anyway, so who gives a fuck? If it's on app or audio interface, nobody gives a fuck. Okay, so song is pretty simple. Let's try it on this first riff. Okay, seven guitar. Second riff. and make some licks because it's slow and boring. Okay. The fourth riff, same as guitar, so we have to just speed it up a bit. Okay. And about bass guitar, just lower it to the maximum going to vocals so vocals we need a pop filter so I made this pop filter it's a homemade pop filter uh, it's a stocking I took this stocking uh, from a dead whore so it smells nice uh, I used some metal in it to make a circle put a stocking of a dead whore on that and you know I made something like this you know and I just put it here like this perfect okay we must you know, just you know uh, uh, you have to balance it you know and uh, you uh, mustn't you know talk here but here so you have to sing like this Okay, now vocals. Just, you know, there aren't rules in black metal, so just scream like a bitch, you know. Uh, I can't uh, do uh, high pitched, you know, scream, so I have to sing uh, low, like. Okay, this might be a little much. Or just go away from the microphone. Uh, and that's it. So add reverb, of course, and it should sound like this. I will fuck with yes. Okay, that's it. About okay, you're done. We come to an end of our little journey about how to record raw black, raw black metal things we can say about it it's pretty simple 
press record, either reverb, it's the only thing you need. They say uh, about producing that 50% is recording, 40% is mixing, and 10% is mastering. That means fuck mastering. We don't need mastering in black metal. I mean, what the fuck? And this is it about our little journey. So, hail. You'll see this song pretty soon. It should be called, it will be called Raw War. Till next time, see ya. Hail. Satan.